Hi everyone, welcome to Washington Reads. I'm Mrs. Lennon. Today I'm gonna to be reading Flying High, the story of gymnastics champion Simone Biles. This is written by Michelle Meadows and illustrated by Ebony Glenn. Flying High. Simone is on the move. Watch her go, go, go. Climbing up, dangling down, swinging high and low. Yet, four siblings struggle. They lack proper care. The future's uncertain. Fear hangs in the air. The children are placed in a foster home with warm meals to eat and a yard to roam. Soon Grandpa arrives, a welcome surprise. Simone takes a trip with hope in her eyes. Climbing up shoulders, bouncing off walls, flipping on the couch, tumbling through the halls. Tip-top trampoline, jump toward the sky. One little girl wants to fly, fly, fly. As time carries on, the siblings must split, an impossible choice to create the right fit. Down at the courthouse, adoption complete, a family forever, a promise so sweet. The girls get excited for an outdoor trip, but rain's coming down, drip, drip, drip. They need a new plan to switch the destination. Their brother suggests the perfect location. High bars, low bars, leap across the beam. Simone copies their moves and launches a dream. Level by level, she's moving up fast, shooting off the vault like a rocket blast. After one special meet, Simone's family grows, now a puppy to love with a big wet nose. From vault to bars on floor and beam, she sets her sights on the national team. She comes so close in the 14th slot, missing the team by only one spot. Crushed by defeat, she loses her spark. What will it take to rise from the dark? Uplifted by love, pulled into the light, Simone rediscovers the magic of flight. Back in the gym, heavy rope to climb, harder routines and more practice time. She makes sacrifices on the path ahead, giving up high school for homeschool instead. Determined to win, she prepares for the beat. Shake, shake, shimmy, tumble to the beat. She loops and swoops and hears the crowd roar. She whips and flips and takes a top score. Rising up through the ranks, there's more work to be done. With her drive to compete, gymnastics is fun. And what does she do when something goes wrong? She gets back up and finishes strong. Fearless and focused, she aims for her goal, impro improving consistency, gaining control. Her signature move shows phenomenal flair, two breathtaking flips high up in the air. Simone is on a roll, watch her go, go, go. She's the best in the world three years in a row. At the Olympics on Team USA, her proud family cheers, final five on display. With fire inside that sets her apart, Simone captures her dream and America's heart. So I'm gonna read a little bit of some facts about Simone Biles. So going for the gold, Simone Biles Olympic journey. She was born on March 14th, 1997. 
She is only four feet, eight inches tall and growing up with family. As a young child, Simone spent time in foster care with her biological siblings, Adria, Ashley, and Tevin. When Simone was six and Adria was four, they were adopted by their biological grandfather, Ron, and his wife, Nellie Biles. Ron and Nellie became their dad and mom. Simone and Adria grew up in Spring, Texas, with their parents and two older brothers, Ron Jr. and Adam. While Ron and Nellie raised Simone and Adria in Texas, Ron's older sister raised Ashley and Tevin in Cleveland, Ohio. So, introduction to gymnastics. Another important event unfolded when Simone was six. Simone and Adria's daycare planned a field trip to a farm, but it rained. Their brother Adam worked at the daycare and suggested instead go to Bannon's Gymnastics in Houston. It didn't take long for a coach to notice Simone's natural talent. Their mother enrolled Simone and Adria in gymnastics lessons soon after the field trip. Simone has worked with many coaches. Amy Borman was remarkably influential and acted as Simone's main coach through the 2016 Olympics. Coach Borman helped Simone get the attention of Martha Caroli, who was the U.S. Women's Gymnastics National Team Coordinator at the time. For the 2020 Olympics in Tokyo, Simone trained with Coach Laurent Landy. Sports psychologist Robert Andrews helped Simone cope with the pressure of competing. All right. Before we end, I want to share some interesting and some amazing facts about Simone Biles and her feat as a gymnast. So in the 2016 Olympics in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, Simone took home four gold medals, vault, floor, individual all around, and team all around, as well as a bronze medal on beam, making history. Simone is one of the most decorated gymnasts in history. She is the first female gymnast ever to win three world all-around titles consecutively in 2013, 2014, and 2015. In 2018, the International Gymnast Federation added the Biles vault to the women's code of points. The vault move involves a round off, a half twist onto the vault table, and a front double full somersault. Also included in the code of points is Simone's signature floor move known as the Biles a double layout with a half twist landing. Simone continues to make history with her record-breaking moves, including a triple double on floor and her double double dismount on the balance beam. Wow. If you have the chance, take a look on YouTube, take a look on the internet, search Simone Biles, look at her routines. You will be absolutely amazed. Okay. I hope you enjoyed hearing about Simone